Welcome to the Neurology Channel, a YouTube channel dedicated to all things neurology. We have a passion for sharing our knowledge and experience with others. On this channel, we cover a wide range of topics related to the brain and nervous system, including common neurological conditions, diagnostic tests, and treatment options. We also discuss the latest research and developments in the field of neurology. Whether you're a medical professional looking to stay up to date with the latest research, or a patient interested in learning more about the brain and how it works, the Neurology Channel has something for you. So, if you're interested in all things neurology, make sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay up to date with all of our latest videos. Thanks for stopping by and we can't wait to share more about the fascinating world of neurology with you. Welcome to our video on cervical dystonia. In this video, we'll explore what it is, the symptoms and impacts it can have on a person's life, the available treatments, coping strategies, and the latest research and progress being made. Cervical dystonia is a neurological disorder that affects the muscles in the neck, causing them to contract involuntarily. This can result in the head being turned to one side, pulled forward or backward, or a combination of these positions. The condition can also cause neck pain, headaches, and difficulty with balance. The symptoms of cervical dystonia can have a significant impact on a person's quality of life, causing pain and discomfort, difficulty with daily activities such as driving, and social isolation. Treatments for cervical dystonia vary depending on the severity of the condition. They may include medications, such as muscle relaxants, injections of botulinum toxin, or physical therapy to strengthen the neck muscles. In more severe cases, surgery may be required to relieve pressure on the nerves in the neck. Coping with cervical dystonia can be challenging, but there are strategies that can help. These include finding a support group, seeking counseling, and practicing stress reduction techniques such as meditation or yoga. Research into cervical dystonia is ongoing, and progress is being made to develop new treatments and improve the quality of life for those affected by the condition. This includes advancements in the use of botulinum toxin injections and new medications that target the underlying causes of the disorder. Thank you for watching this video on cervical dystonia. If you or someone you know is living with this condition, remember that there are treatments and coping strategies available. And stay hopeful, because research is ongoing, and progress is being made to improve the lives of those affected. Thank you for watching the Neurology Channel. We hope you found this video informative and useful. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comments section below. Don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel if you want to stay up to date with all of our latest videos. We post new content every week so make sure to check back often for more insights and information on all things neurology. If you're interested in learning more about a specific topic, let us know in the comments and we'll do our best to cover it in a future video. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.